systems online, flight controls checked, cleared for pushback. Turn left heading 290. Traffic at your 12, 7 miles. Roger, 290, Clipper 23. Clipper 61, descend and maintain flight level 200. Confirming the handoff on sector 4. Selected heading 280. Heading 280 selected, mode control panel checked. Look at the fuel flow on two. Looks stable, acknowledged. JTV 431, confirm altitude. Affirmative, level 330. Delta 49er cleared to land runway 27 right. Roger that, 27 right. Clipper 61, turn left heading 300. Malaysian 370, confirm altitude. Affirmative, flight level 350. Have a new contact bearing zero nine or zero. No transponder. Confirming the trace is weak but continuous. Monitor closely. The fuselage is rendered partially transparent, revealing the intricate layout of the flight deck.
The serial number is partially obscured right here. Yeah, we can try an infrared scan to bring it out. Look at the shear pattern on this strut. It suggests extreme velocity impact. The caliper reading is showing significant stress fractures here. Sure. Correlating that with the thermal data now, the serial numbers match the manifest. Show me something different. Just one anomaly. Hold on. Mark that position. Right there. We have a hard contact. Coordinates locked. Dynamic positioning active. Let's see what you are. Personal effects, seats, luggage. My God. Positive ID on the livery. We have the Malaysia Airlines logo. This is MH370. Floor structure is compromised. We have a clear path to the lower cargo deck. Manifest confirmed. The rumors were true. That is. That is a significant amount of bullion. There it is. The CVR. It's intact. I repeat, the recorder is intact. Steady, grip is secure. Extracting now. Gentle, gentle. Recorder secured. Recovering loose cargo samples. We're not leaving this behind. Phase one complete. Evidence secured. Lock those pins. Double check the hydraulics. We only get one shot at this. The fuselage is fragile. If the cradle fails, the plane disintegrates. Cradle is on the deck. Position looks good. Stable on the starboard side. Jetting the path for strap one. Watch the hole, don't touch the skin. It's paper thin. Easy on the tension. She's buckling. 10% torque only. Tension at 40%. She's waking up. Watch for the dust shake. Venting observed at frame 42. Internal pressure equalizing. Maintaining ascent speed at 0.5 meters per second. Passing 800 meters. I have visual. She's, she's huge. The structure looks stable. Huh. 
hull is slimy but solid. Barnacle growth is heavy on the rivet lines. She's weeping Ten years of ocean inside her We got you. You're safe now. Giant 7, this is Fremantle Port Control. You are cleared for approach to berth 10. Pilot boat is en route. They're all here. Every net worth on the planet. Take up tension. Clear the deck. Locked on. All clear. Hoist away slow. Load on deck. Suspension active. We are green for transport. The convoy is now moving north towards the secure facility, a solemn sight for everyone watching. Center line, keep it on the center line. Easy, bring her home. Scanning sector four. Mapping the formation patterns on the port side cargo door. Corrosion has welded it shut. The locking mechanism is gone. We'll have to force it. Clear back! She's gonna pop! Pressure at 10,000 PSI. The smell. It's the, the smell. <sighs> Get the lights in there. Pallet PMC 1422. It's thermal runaway. It started here. It burned straight up. Main equipment center. A cars. Transponder. It took them all out in seconds. It was secured from the inside. Deadbolt engaged. Whatever happened in there happened alone. Almost through. Captain's seat. Transponder set to standby. It wasn't a fire. He turned it off. Memory board extracted. Salt corrosion is minimal. Pins are clean. Attempting interface. We have it. Play the last file. Phase one. Channel two is dead. Channel one, steady respiration. He's still alone. He's just breathing. Six hours. He sat there for six hours, waiting for the fuel to run out. Right engine flame out. Left engine flame out. AC bus lost. Recorder power gone. Passenger 12A. Recovered. The data is conclusive. The transponder was manually disabled. The turn back was intentional. At 1.21 a.m. the aircraft made a sharp manual turn west. For six hours, autopilot engaged, no communication.
Mission complete. The file is closed. But they will never be forgotten. The sea keeps its secrets. But sometimes, 